واستعينوا بالصبر والصلاة وإنها لكبيرة إلا على الخاشعين السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته my brothers and sisters welcome back to our beautiful Ramadan series in stealing the hope in today's episode we will be talking about the tests of life and how Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tells us in the Quran that he surely will test each and every single one of us and how the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam has told us as well that Allah loves those he tests when Allah loves you he tests you in Allah idha ahabba abdan ibdalahu if Allah loves a worshiper of his he tests them and Allah tells us in the Quran we are going through all this because we want hope and we want to tell ourselves and tell you, my brothers, my sisters, tests is not a sign of the displeasure of Allah. You want hope. You need to understand this. Allah says we will definitely test you with a little bit of fear or joy and hunger and loss of wealth and lives and farm produce but give glad tidings to those who are patient قَالُوا إِنَّا لِلَّهِ وَإِنَّا إِلَيْهِ رَاجِعُونَ Those whom when a disaster or a calamity befalls them, the first thing they say is, Indeed, we belong to Allah and on to Him is our return. أُولَٰئِكَ عَلَيْهِمْ صَلَوَاتٌ مِّن رَبِّهِمْ وَرَحْمَةٌ وَأُولَٰئِكَ هُمُ الْمُمْتَدُونَ they are the ones whom upon them is mercy and blessings from their Lord. And they are the ones who are rightly guided. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tells us. And Allah says in Surah Al-Ankabut. Alif Laam. <laughs> Allah says, do the people think that they will be left to say they believe or we believe and they will not be tested? It's a powerful question. You believe in Allah? Know that tests are coming your way. That is hope for you. That you should have hope in the mercy of Allah and know Allah is going to test you. Allah will surely test you. Subhanahu wa ta'ala and Allah wants to see how your reaction is going to be. He loves you. That's why he is testing you. You need to understand this. My brothers, my sisters, you want hope. Be patient when these tests come your direction. Then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the same surah, Surah Al Ankabut, chapter 29. We've read the first and second verse, the third verse, Allah says. وَلَقَدْ فَتَنَّ الَّذِينَ مِنْ قَبَلِهِمْ فَلَيَعْلَمَنَّ اللَّهُ الَّذِينَ صَدَقُوا وَلَيَعْلَمَنَّ الْكَاذِبِينَ But we have certainly tried, tested those before them and Allah will surely make evident who? Two people. Those who are truthful and he will surely make evident the liars. We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to grant us the hope. We are searching for my brothers, my sisters. Be patient and Allah will grant you hope. Everyone will die. One day, eventually, we will all die. Allah says, Surah Al-Anbiya, verse 35. Kullu nafsin dha'ikatul maut. What does Allah say? And he's, this is where our focus is. Then Allah says, وَنَبَلُوكُمْ بِالشَّرِّ وَالْخَيْرِ فِتْنَةً وَإِلَيْنَا تُرْجَعُونَ Allah says, every soul shall taste death. And we test you with evil and with good as a trial. And to us, you will be returned. Allah is telling us again, those tests we are running away from are going to come. You want hope? 
be patient work hard accept them as part of the love of allah and walk towards passing the tests the prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam said what does the prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam say and i've told you we, are, we said this before inna allah idha ahab abdan ibtalahu if allah subhanahu wa ta'ala loves a servant he tests them he tests them and if allah loves a servant as well in another hadith what does he do he takes from them he he takes from them in other words he affects them with trials we ask allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to grant us hope my brothers my sisters develop a link with allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and see how your life will change we have to understand this hope allah grants you want it you have to believe and you have to have a link with allah and you will surely have it inshallah we meet in the next episode barakallahu feekum aqulu qawli hadha wassalamu alaykum wa rahmatullah wasta'inu bis sabri was salah wa innaha lakabiratun illa 'alal khashi'in